a truck driver, not a politician. I'm an ordinary, average American who's gotten involved to bring constitutional government back to what it's meant to be. Mr. Brown's representative said, he commented that, that government can make the wealthy wealthy so that their wealth will trickle down on the masses. Or that government can make the masses wealthy so everyone prospers. The fact is, federal government doesn't exist to make anyone wealthy. Federal government exists to make us free. Government exists to protect our liberty. You'll hear a lot of candidates talk about what government does. I'm going to talk about what the Constitution does. The Constitution limits our federal government. And the role constitutionally of a United States Senator is to protect the state from the federal government. I'm the only candidate who defines the job that way. And if, if our senators were doing that, we'd be much more prosperous in the states because our, our wealth wouldn't be going to our federal government. If he's staying here in the states. Why should our resources be going to Washington so that the states and the counties and local governments can beg to get them back? Wouldn't it be better if the resources stayed here where they belong? The Constitution limits federal government. Federal government has two roles. To provide security and infrastructure to the states so the states can do everything else. The federal government hasn't behaved that way for a very long time. Another thing that the Constitution does is it gives the power to us, to the individual, to play a role in our government. Constitutionally, there are only two qualifications to be a United States Senator. That I be over 30 years old and a citizen for more than nine years. I am qualified, and you are qualified to play a role in government. And I'm setting the example so that ordinary Americans will step up and play a role in our government because it's necessary that we do. There's no reason why we should expect that people who have made careers of politics would do anything to limit their own authority. <coughs> it's our job. The Constitution gives us that, that privilege of protecting our government, of protecting ourselves from our government. The Constitution protects us, and it protects us all equally. It protects Republicans from Democrats, and Democrats from Republicans, liberals, and, and conservatives alike question is, who is protecting our Constitution? <coughs> We're not doing it. Government of, by, and for the people requires our participation as legislators, as candidates. We complain. We complain about career politicians. If, if we require our legislators, our federal legislators, to start in local government, and then work up to state government, and then eventually to federal government. What choices do we have other than career politicians? That's our job. Federal government should be the weakest branch. Our communities should be where, where strong governments are, because we're close. We have the power to control our local government. You can go down and visit your mayor. It's a little more difficult to visit your senator. We have the power to change that. I'm Scott Rupert. I'm a candidate for the United States Senate. My website is scottrupert.com. I'd appreciate it if you go there. Listen to what I have to say. There's a lot of videos there. If you think what I'm saying makes sense, share it with your friends. Because we have the power to control our government if we get involved.